All right, ladies and gentlemen, you'll notice I have a couple other videos, and I'm in the same clothing. I'm shooting multiple videos on this date, the 20th of August, 2014. This video, I didn't catch the headlines, the actual news report. So, unfortunately, I don't know all the details, but I understand that ISIS, ISIS, the Iraqi group that is being considered a terrorist group has killed hundreds if not tens of thousands of Iraqis. Took it upon themselves to kill another journalist who I believe was from America. And they literally took his head off from what I understand. They beheaded him. I have to say something about that, friends and family around the globe. People say, well, they're sick. They're terrorists, or they're sick. And, you know, I feel that it's almost like dismissing it as, well, of course they did something that sickening. They're sick. I can't even fathom how a person chops the head off of another human being. The only thing I can figure is maybe at some point they were butchers. No offense to people that are in the profession of butchering. But maybe they worked on animals at some point, killing them, taking their heads off, so it didn't emotionally affect them to cut off a human being's head. I don't know. Maybe they throw away their emotions. Or maybe their hate for people that are not their religion or their politics or whatever. Maybe that's what gives them the, I don't know, the, the, the non-heart to be able to do something like that. I don't know what it is. I can't even fathom how somebody does it. Just like Jeffrey Dahmer and all these other serial killers that lived in America and around the globe. I don't know how somebody dismembers another human being. I have a hard time thinking they dismember an animal. Yeah, I know I'm not a vegetarian. I agree. I would love to be. Maybe someday I will be. But how do you kill somebody in that manner? It's bad enough you're killing somebody, but to take off their head. Or to digest them as a cannibal. You know, just speaking these words almost makes me physically ill. Now, I don't know how all of you feel about it, but I think the world, every living human being needs to speak up, needs to say something, and get our governments of this globe to do something about it. We the people, need to force upon the governments to end terrorism, to do something. And I know it sounds like the impossible dream, but nothing's impossible. Do you have faith? Do you believe? Maybe you're an atheist. Do you have faith of some kind? You believe in something. Maybe you don't believe in an entity that most of us call God. Maybe you're Jewish, you don't believe Jesus died and rose again. I don't know. But surely, most people on this earth have a heart, have compassion and love. Are you outraged by this? I ask all of you to do something that you may find impossible, but I ask you to just start petitions. Petition our government. United States, your government. Maybe you're in uh, Mumbai, India. Oh, hopefully I said it right. Maybe you're in Pakistan. Maybe you're in Russia. I don't care. We've got to stop terrorism. We got to stop rape. We've got to stop genocide. We've got to stop wars around the globe. We've got to be a people with humanity, with compassion, with love. You know. 
Right now as we speak, there are literally tens of thousands of nuclear bombs on the planet. And everybody on Earth, all seven billion of us, more than seven billion, don't maybe think about it, but live each day knowing a couple of those go off, that's it for humanity. We have the capacity to end our species 100%. We have the capacity to kill everything on this planet except maybe cockroaches. What about that? You, are you outraged by it? Start making petitions about this terrorism. What should the United States do? Well, we're in a bad position. We don't want to have a, a third war in Iraq. Really, we don't want a third one. I don't want to see another American soldier, for that matter, any soldier dying for it. But, we gotta figure something out. We gotta do something about the Sudan and South Sudan. We gotta figure something out. So from people around the globe who watch this, I don't care what nation you're in, start online petitions. Let's make this not only a viral video, but a viral video of substance, a viral video that changes lives. If somebody will make a petition and email it to ACTORAJ2, I will do it. Hey, I might make one, but so far I made a few, but I'm not really great at the promotion end of it. So I haven't gotten a lot of signatures. Gotta do something. Call your senators, call your congressmen, call your presidents, call your ministers. Got to do something. We can't let what happened in Iraq or anywhere on earth continue. And yes, we can actually change the world for the better. So with that, listen. Every one of us matters. Even those evil people matter to somebody. But let's stop the wars. Let's stop the killings and the terrorism, but that I will remind you that you know what? You and humanity really does matter. So thank you for your time.